for De Koning. Advantage. Advantage is paid. Seb Ross, the first inside 50. Appeared to have his arm held. Jack Higgins, free kick. And they're going to pay advantage to Owens, who has taken it. And fortunately for him, kicked the goal. In views, one of the twins for the Cats. Along with Tom Hawkins, runs his full measure. Off to Atkins. Gresham applies the pressure. That's Gonski. Turn over here. Yeah, absolutely lean. Desperate stuff in the end from Buse. Pinged again. King the tackler. Over the ball. Higgins wanted to go. Probably 50. a little lucky because Duncan was waiting 50. for him. 50, 50 the call. Saints get their second and lead by 13. 50. Saints will get their second. And it's a punchy start. With the hands of Zach Guthrie. Memory. Little give. Now a chance for Butler. Pretty good finisher, kicks and goals. Saints have got three. Butler has his first. Early going, Dangerfield gets caught in the court. He tackled, got the handball away. Myers squeezes the ball. Close. Now to Guthrie. Guthrie from 40 out straight in front. Cats get their first. Mitch Owens doing the backup ruck work as he's done for a bit throughout the year. Draws a free kick. The centre bounce, just dumping long kick. Cooper Sharman from front of the side. Max King, how clean. Big contested mark. Max King's got a couple of early goals here. Wrapped up by Filippo. Myers, good little step. Got around Wanganay Miller. The kick will be okay. It's a live one in front of Hawkins. Cleared the path for Stengel. If he gets a good bounce, it's going to be an important goal. He gets a brilliant bounce. He's got to bullet the ball. Jacob Mollison, the umpire, says, Tommy, not going to happen. I think he did. Not the 15 player on the court, Colin Jasny. Not sure whether he's heard it. Doesn't matter much. Under no pressure. Back towards... Henry, who somehow got rid of the tackle battle, would have loved his time again with the mark. Saw a bit of it, but Brad Hill, who chance out the back, Neil, not quite, picking up cleanly. Wanganin Miller off to Marshall. Not sure who was looking for it, certainly wasn't Isaac Smith. Inside 50, the Cats go again. Mitch Duncan, kick four for the year, Mitch Duncan, all singles. Cats need this. Duncan delivers. Unbelievably, it's just a seven-point game. Cats have just had eight and the margin remarkably only seven points. Here's still following up his work. Centering kick, Cooper Sharman, juggling it to the mark, got it. Elvis Norm Smith medalist, Bowes. Into the pocket towards Hawkins. Under Clark, heard the call from Butler. He to get himself away from close. On to the left, Marshall now. Again, there's an example of good decision-making. It's a quick turnover. The ball's in your forward half. You're able then to play with Lincoln speed. It's when... Last, he pulled to the left. That's perfect. It's an early win for the Saints here. Into the forward pocket, King, Owens, Mason, Wood, big fly. Just not quite getting the connection right, the Cats. Can they get a mark? Saints defenders might have been a bit overzealous. It's a free kick. Advantage is going to be paid. Holmes takes it, and that's the goal the Cats wanted. Rolls around, sees the spare man. King had a little break. Thought about the handball, gives in the end. Sinclair crosses the arc. A well-weighted ball, brilliant to Higgins. It was brilliant, Hammer. It was a great call. To Webster. Webster now on that left of his. Goes and finds Butler, but he didn't take the mark. Left it behind. Colin Jasny couldn't complete the handle. Saints get out of trouble. Stand. We're really impressed with the St. Kilda pressure. Rowan Marshall, what an enormous player he is, and almost a soccer bicycle kick. Owens claimed the mark, play on the call. Cooper Sharman back to Filippo, and they've got a number out. The Saints can get rolling. It's Jack Higgins who works as hard as anyone on the field. He's got up to the wing. He's charging back. 
Butler got options everywhere. Why not go to Max King? Well done to Koning. Picked up Filippo. Spinning. Brilliant effort. Mateus Filippo with one of the best. And forced along slow. Back behind the mark. It is so impressive. The Cats season hanging by a thread. Myers on the left. Hawkins a target. He's found. Take the mark. Sakes trying to strike back immediately through their skipper steal. Oh, good effort, Cooper Sharman. How good a mark. Over the top. Little chance for Rowan Marshall, who's been superb tonight. Filippo, not a lot of wriggle room. Still a chance for Owens. And the Saints and Higgins. Higgins gets another. And the Saints skip away to a 32-point lead. Now Cameron puts it to about 20 out directly in front. Saints through hands. Buse will get them. They're in, you think, by Tui. Puts it into the back of the net. And then just a hopeful spiral that doesn't really go anywhere at all. Crouch tried to get a fist into it. Didn't work out. Owens went up, went to ground. Atkins comes and emerges with the football. Kicks towards goal. And the Cats are still alive. Close to the line, King flies with Rowan Marshall. Rowan Marshall. Kicks a beauty. Have a look at the enjoyment. The St Kilda fans have got at the moment. There's Marshall again, worked underneath it. Occasion by Guthrie, and that sums up a bit of the Cats' night. Kicked it into the back of Neil. Can they get another one? Dan Butler's got it. It's a party at Marvel Stadium for the Saints. It's the Saints by 33 points at Marvel Stadium in front of 40,000. A comprehensive win over the reigning premiers. Such a great performance by the team. Yeah, it was. We've really improved the last few weeks, and it's a long year. You had ups and downs, and we started the year well, fell off a bit, but um, yeah, it's starting to hit a bit of form. Not too sure it's happening with other results, but. Yeah, great effort tonight, and yeah, amazing atmosphere, of course. Awesome. You are one step closer to playing finals football. Yes, there are still results, and there's still next week, but it felt like this group was right up, knowing how important this game was. Yeah, we were really set ourselves for the big game tonight. Um, yeah, we've been a lot of talk every week's a final and stuff like that, but yeah, we try to keep pretty level-headed and just focus on the process. Um, yeah, it's hard not to get caught up in the results, obviously, and, and think too far ahead, and and all that sort of stuff, but um, yeah, feel like we really lived in the moment tonight, and um, yeah, the game had its ups and downs, but thought we fought it out really well.